Frank Bruno, who is notoriously outspoken about his mental health battles, has detailed the string of events that led up to his sectioning during lockdown. The 60-year was hospitalized after suffering a terrifying relapse in his battle with bipolar disorder, a condition that causes extreme mood swings. Frank had previously told how his health spiraled after losing four of his friends to coronavirus. Speaking on ITV's Good Morning Britain, Frank explained he managed to re-emerge from his depression after adhering to a strict training routine. Speaking of his sectioning, Frank explained he was the last to know what was happening when the ambulance pulled up outside his house. He described the experience as weird and strange, but explained he managed to emerge from his plight by training all the time. Crazy people might not understand it, he explained. There are 24 hours in a day, you should give your body and your mind and your should 2 hours to look out for yourself. It's simple as well. Mental health pandemic? COVID is taking terrible toll on our children's well-being it comes as the fighter prepares to release his new memoir, titled Frank Bruno, 60 Years a Fighter, this month. In it, the 60-year-old describes the anguish suffered by his friends and family after he was sectioned in June 2020. The fighter also details failures over his care, after a nurse shared a picture of the boxer taken during his hospital stay on social media. In a previous interview, Frank revealed, I went to hell and back during the lockdown and ended up at rock bottom. Don't miss, high cholesterol, the common vitamin deficiency link to condition, inside stroke, the fruit that could have your risk of having a stroke. Tips, coronavirus, the symptom currently seen in 73% of people fully jabbed, latest, at times I wondered if I'd get through it. It was the most terrifying time of my life. But now I am ready to tell the full story about what happens. The boxer is using his experience to help combat the current mental health epidemic by launching a new campaign via his charity. The boxer said he was pushed to the brink after suffering the loss of his friends during lockdown, but explained this enabled him to put his life into perspective. Speaking to The Sun last year, he said, There have been some really dark days which have pushed me right to the brink. But I am still here and still fighting and that's what I will always try to do. The hardest thing about losing so many friends during lockdown was not being able to go to the funeral and say goodbye. The friends I have lost are guys who have been friends for most of my life, and long before I became famous. It's made me realize just how precious life is and how horrendous this virus has been for many. Frank also revealed he turned to fellow fighter Ricky Hatton for support after his life spiraled out of control. But the boxer is using his experience to help combat the mental health endemic brought on by COVID-19 by launching a new campaign via his charity. Bipolar disorder, also clinically known as manic depression, affects a whopping one. 3 million people in the UK. But Frank hopes his campaign will bring hope to these sufferers by helping to break the stigma around mental health and provide an encouraging platform for people to come together and share their thoughts, 